previously on Phillips Fan Band. Oh my gosh, I have no idea how this is gonna turn out. I'm hoping it'll be okay. We're gonna have a couple cameras on them. Welcome to another vlog who I just opened the blinds and there's so much dust right here anyways you guys today Literally, we have not been doing much. It's been kind of a, like a cleanup catch-up kind of day Which unfortunately sometimes summer requires you having to be an adult and get things done and blah 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 So today we are actually going through the kids closets right now as you can see back there We actually have one of the doors off. We actually have two of the doors off that need to go back on but before we put those doors back on, we are going to go through all of the kids' clothes. I want to get rid of like all of their winter stuff that, that's not going to fit them this next year. Um, and just get rid of clothes that don't fit them or whatever. I know that you guys have seen a video of us doing Poshmark before. So this video also, we will be doing Poshmark again and putting things up on that app that we can sell. It's actually a super easy app where you can just download the app. It's absolutely free no charge at all whatsoever and it's so easy to maneuver I'll show you guys how we kind of do it but it's pretty awesome because you can go on there and find things in your location that you're looking for whether to sell or to buy it's really really awesome we've done it before and we've actually sold items on there and literally they send you the postage and you print it out stick it to the envelope and then send it off it is as easy as that you guys as we walk you guys through this closet clean out I'll show you guys how to do it but I'll also show you kind of what we're gonna do to keep this closet organized and clean because it is kind of a mess right now I feel like sometimes the kids throw stuff in there when they're cleaning their rooms and things like that so first up we are starting on Ethan and Elijah's closet, gonna get that conquered, and then hopefully we have time today to move on to Emberlin's. If not, we'll do that in another video, but right now, it's the boys' closet. Boom shakalaka, here we go. You ready, Elijah? Yeah, and just, and just like, when your parents go say, come on, let's go, let's go, let's go take a job. You go on this chair, <laughs> uh -huh. if you're lazy, you just go on this chair. And just pretend like you're jogging. Yeah. Nice. I don't think you're fooling anyone though. What do you think? Well, maybe if you don't show the chair. Yeah, that's true. That's true. What chair? I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's weird. All right, dude, you ready to help me with your closet? Kind of and kind of not. You're kind of. It looks like a dump. It looks like a dump. I wonder why. So here is, this is Elijah's side of the closet. So these are all of his clothes Guys, that we want to go through. The thing is that we just put the old stuff that we don't use anymore in here. When when I was a little younger, when I would I when I would take one of my pieces of clothes, I would take this off, go like this. Oh, this the truth like comes out, man. Like that, so. Are you kidding me? Don't do that anymore. Okay, well I'm I glad I'm glad to hear that you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you better not do that either, <laughs> little stink. It's, it could be worse. I feel it like can. this closet has been worse. It hasn't. The, <laughs> yes, it has. I, know, I have yeah. seen books. Look at your books look pretty darn good. They don't look horrible. So we're going to go through here, check this out, I kind of clean, clean out, out this whole area right here. We're going to go through each item of clothing to see what we're going to keep, what we're going to donate, and what we are going to sell on Poshmark. And then just kind of see what's all over there, you guys. Practically, most of these clothes are, are old. The ones in the closet that are piled up are old, most likely. The clothes? Yeah. All right, well, let's check it out. And then, Elijah, you want to help hey, me? I see a pile of clothes. All right, Elijah, so do you want to help me post the things on the um, Poshmark? Yes. Okay, you'll see how easy it is, too. I don't know how easy it is. What if it's really hard? What if it's so hard? All right, so let's check this out. So, Elijah, you get to help me out and decide what we're going to keep and what we're going to donate and what we're going to sell, okay? Yes, and actually, we we could probably sell a lot of this because this is still in really good condition. Not really. Yes, these not clothes the are... Not the jersey. Like, does not this still fit you, dude? What? Does this still fit you? No, actually, no. It doesn't. Hold it's it like, up. It would be super tight on me. I think so. By the time you can wear long sleeves again... That might 
Be too short. Be too, dude. You're growing up. Stop it. I just, All right. So I think this is still gonna fit you next year. Let me see. That'll still fit you. Cause that was. Um, don't take it off the hanger. You're making more work, dude. No, don't worry. I'll put it back up. I'll show you. Yeah, this will be good. That'll still be good. This so. Be I will do anything just to get you back again. I will do anything at all. No, I'm not innocent. You deserve a better man. But let me just hold your hand once more. Ooh, 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 ooh. I wanna take you out. Ooh, 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 ooh. Show you what I'm all about. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Make up for what we lost. Okay, guys, right now I am going to clean out all of our dirty stuff in here. We already have like a pile of clothes. For like if we're gonna donate them this is for all Poshmark because they're all they're not ruined or anything some yeah. of these actually have their tags on them still yeah, so some of them like they don't fit me anymore and some of them I wouldn't just I, I like, wouldn't wear it like I these there's like a vest and I don't wear vest kind of thing right and here we've got one here, for donation so here, far so yeah so we're gonna show you guys here right now how we upload this to poshmark um to sell and then anything we don't sell we just donate so and so right now since we're all done with all my clothes we are going to clean out the whole closet oh man this is gonna be so fun look look at this whole pile this right here is what i'm worried about just the whole i honestly think it looks worse than it actually is because if you, know you look underneath right. here I mean, it's not like there's a ton of stuff. There's just like shoes and stuff. So we, like we, I like, have seen what worse. The dartboard? Like, I don't know. Hang it up yeah, we'll figure that out. Okay. All right, so here we go. We are gonna go into the app. So Elijah, go ahead and push Poshmark, and then we have our account already set up. And you guys, it's so easy to set up an account, get your account going on here. Um, so basically, down here, what we're gonna do is we want to sell. So we're gonna hit sell, and then it brings up the camera to take a picture of the product. So basically, yeah. lay it out nicely, Elijah. So we're gonna go one by one. Guys, this is really easy, and it's really easy just to sell, sell these clothes. So here we go. Okay, so here we go. We got the picture, and then Elijah, go ahead and hit next at the top. Oh, by the way, you could change the You color. can filter it, but we don't need to. Yeah, but we don't need to. Just to give you an idea of what, if, if you wanna do it, so next. Okay, so basically here, you guys, is this is the screen where you're going to just um, tell about the item. So it's going to say, what are you selling? So you put that in, um, then you're going to describe it, and then you're going to do how many, the size, the brand, color, all of that stuff. Um, you're going to let them know if it needs tag or if it has tags or doesn't have tags, and then you're going to do um, the original price if you know it, and then what you're selling it for. It's as easy as that. So I got all of these posted on Poshmark. They're all ready to go. So we're just going to leave those on there. And then now we're going to just real quickly work on getting all of this cleaned up because all of his clothes have been gone through. And it's nice just to declutter the clothes and kind of get them out of here and have some extra hangers for all of your clean clothes, huh? Wait a minute. So we're cleaning out the closet now. Yes. Yeah, so now we're going to clean out the bottom of the closet now that we got all of the clothes um, taken care of. And so guys... Poshmark is awesome. Totes awesome, baby. Very, very easy to post them and everything. Yeah, very easy to post, very easy to use. Um, I'm all, you guys know, we're all about easy peasy, and Poshmark is definitely an easy way to get your clothes out there to sell, or other things too, uh, um, aside from clothes. They have many different things that you can sell in there. Go check it out, you guys. You can upload it for free, super easy. Just maneuver it and go see how easy it is to use. Um, but right now, we are going to clean this closet out. Night is the night that we're gonna fall in love. I don't care about you and him. I don't care about what has been. I only care about your soft skin. Cause we're still sleeping in my head. I don't care about you and him. I don't care about what has been. I only care about your soft skin. Cause we're still sleeping in my head.
right, you guys, so we're getting there. So we decided that we're gonna put all the shoes here on top, which just works awesome because it takes, it um, gives a little bit more floor space for whatever. Um, and then here, what I'm gonna have Elijah do right now is put all of the long sleeve ones towards the back of the closet and all the short sleeve ones in the front. Because right now he's not really wearing long sleeve because it's like 114 degrees in Las Vegas. So I'm going to have him do that real quick. Um, but it's totally coming together. It's looking pretty good. Yeah, look, at, look at from here and then from um, when we So we left a few things in here, a few of their toys, which is honestly that's not that bad compared to what it was. It's just okay. feeling a lot better. Okay. So Elijah's going to go through and do all the long sleeves, all the short sleeves, all the colored shirts and organize them and get that all nice. All right, so we got them. We got short sleeve, short sleeve, short sleeve with collar, short sleeve with collar. We've got church clothes here. And, and then all the long sleeves in the back. Yes, because he's not wearing the long sleeves for the summer, we've just kind of put them back here knowing that they'll, they're going to fit him when it gets colder most likely. So we're just going to leave him back there so that he doesn't take them all off I'll, so like, and put I'll, him in the like, dirty clothes. I'll probably wear them in like probably winter or like... Winter or fall. Yeah. Yeah. Because I have found that like a lot of the time the kids will pull off their clothes, and whether they're long sleeve or short sleeve without even realizing, and then be like, oh, this is long sleeve, and then they'll just throw it, and then it ends up in the laundry, and I end up having to do more and more laundry. So this way he kind of knows like those clothes right there, he's not going to be wearing. Um, these clothes in the front are what he's going to be wearing, and um, all of his clean laundry can be hung up and organized the way that it is right now. This is looking pretty dang clean. Pretty dang clean, right? It feels good when you do something and it looks really nice. Nice, huh? We have one little problem. Uh-oh, what? Side. Yes, we do still have to do Ethan's side, but I since have an idea. But since I have something going on tonight, maybe Dad and you can conquer that one. Maybe. Or Dad and Ethan. Maybe. All right, you guys, I feel like this looks pretty dang good. Check this out. Boom, way better than what it was, huh? Yeah, way better. You now, feel good about that? Yeah, now I can sleep in here. Oh, perfect. Dad's got to put this door back on though because I never know how. All right, so as you guys have seen, Tina's been totally getting our Poshmark closet all set up. Right now, I'm gonna, I just got, I literally just showered. What time is it? It's, it's literally almost like eight o'clock. And so summertime, you guys know, there's late night dinners. We are gonna go to... Cafe Rio! Oh yeah. Cafe Rio! Oh yeah, what are you gonna be getting? Do you know? Um, I'm gonna get a pork quesadilla. Nice. Oh. Okay guys, right now we are heading into Cafe Rio to get some grub because we are hungry. Okay, it's hung we're hungry. Our tummies, our tummies get empty and then we have to eat. Right guys? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and they shall start growling at you. Yeah. Yeah. They roar like this. Roar! Like a lion, like her tummies do that. I don't know why. Guys, yes. yes. <laughs> <laughs> Mine's about to do that right now. You and I, we're always on the edge. let everyone know that you have another tooth that's loose. Oh my gosh, you're not gonna have any teeth. Boom, what'd you get, Elijah? Um, I got um, a sweet pork quesadilla. Ooh -wee. What'd you get, MZ? Same thing. Ooh. I got two sweet pork enchiladas with rice and beans. Ethan got... Steak nachos. Steak nachos, so good. Sour cream and guacamole on the side. Nice. Ethan. And Bashi got the... Um, pork burrito. Nice. And they kind of like butchered it. Oh. <laughs> so when you get a soda or a drink like that, do you mix it? If you mix it, how do you mix your soda? Ethan goes sometimes like Sprite and lemonade. Or what? 
Sprite. Just Sprite? I what do you, when, oh, what do you do? I used to go Sprite, root beer, Fanta, and lemonade. What? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Ash, what about you? What do you mix? Do you ever mix? No? What do you get? What's your soda of choice? Dr. Pepper. Dr. Pepper. What about you, dude? Always mix here. Okay, what's your concoction? Okay, first, I do, I do lemonade, then root beer, then Sprite, then Fanta, then lemonade, then Fanta. All in the same cup? Yep. Oh my That's goodness. Why I was does that even, the does that even taste good? <laughs> what do you get, sweetie girl? Lemonade and Sprite. Lemonade and Sprite? Mm -hmm. Do you have fruit punch right now or what? Yeah? Mm -hmm. Alright, so we are back from Cafe Rio. I'm barely able to walk up the stairs, you guys. Is that good? Yeah. So what are you doing now? I'm gonna go play Roblox with Ethan and Ember. So they're all three gonna play Roblox with each other. Oh, I hit the camera. Oh man, I gotta clean up this mess, you guys. Oh. Hey. Uh, you a closet makeover. Why can't you do a messy desk cleaner? We will very soon. Okay. I told Tina I was going to do the other half of the closet, so I've got to go check it out right now. I have no idea what I need to do. I probably have to put these closet doors back up, but I also need to clean Ethan's side of the closet. Let's see. Oh, wow. Look at that, you guys. Boom. Nice and clean. I'll put this door back on, and then we'll see what's behind there. All right, so literally, I think it's just clothes that he's thrown out there. So I'm going to clear all of that out right now. That's totally fine. There's not much in here. He's keeping a, it's a pretty clear closet. I'm wondering if Tina came in here and cleaned some of this up. So I'll just get all that out, and we'll be good to go for this awesome... Poshmark closet clean out. So seriously, it was literally just some clothes that probably fell down from the hanger. Some of these shirts, I'm gonna check with Tina, the Green Bay shirt, I think those are too small. So if we don't have it for Emberlin, we might put those on the Poshmark. So I'm gonna just check with Tina on those, but there might be some cool Green Bay jerseys that we have up on our Poshmark. So make sure to go check it out and see what we've got going on on our Poshmark closet. You might just find something that you like. Check this out, just found a shirt. Literally, it's an awesome Zoo York shirt and still has the tags on it. Must have gotten it for, as a gift, probably from my mom. And totally, it's not even Ethan's size anymore, but it will fit Elijah. So unless he doesn't like it, he's gonna keep it. But you guys, it, it's crazy how sometimes when you just like clean out a closet, you're like, oh my goodness, I had that because Literally, this is an awesome shirt. He probably would have worn it if we actually looked through it or went back there and cleaned it out. But hey, these are sometimes the things you find when you're doing a clean out. You find clothes that you've never worn before. All right, honestly, that was really easy. Totally cleared out. I just got some baseball cards back there. Actually surprised, Ethan, if you're watching this, good job, bud, that you just didn't throw everything into the back corner of your closet because that was real easy. So as far as the clothes, we've gone through those. Everything's good. There's some things I've noticed up on top of the closet that we're probably going to save for the next time and we'll add to our, our Poshmark closet then. But we've got more shoes like cleats, things like that, that the kids maybe wear for one season and then they're done. So we um, will probably clean those up, put those on Poshmark and just see if there's a chance that someone may want them. You know, a lot of times we spend all this money on cleats and shoes for like a season and then they grow out of it and you're like, oh my gosh, this is like almost brand new. And it's like, at least you could put it out there, try to make a little bit on it or get a little bit of that money back to put towards the next season. And know sometimes it's easy just to donate, but when you spend money on like cleats and things like that that are seasonal, sometimes you wanna get a little bit back to put towards the next season because it's like an ongoing thing with their sports. So that'll probably come up on the next one where we'll do more shoes. See, because I see some cleats right there that I know that they're not gonna wear. And I see some 
wrestling shoes right there that they tried once or twice and then they stopped doing wrestling. We'll check those out for next time. Stay tuned for that or just go to our Poshmark store to see when we, um, when we upload things onto the store. Um, just just randomly. We might just be putting things up there randomly, so check it out. Stay tuned for our updates. All right, you guys, so thanks for watching. Don't forget to download the Poshmark app uh, from the link in the description below. And once you add that, uh, that app to your phone, go ahead and add us, Phillips Fan Bam, on Poshmark so we can create a network there of all of us fan bammers together. And don't forget to comment down below in the comments and put your Poshmark name so that way all the fan bammers we can connect with each other and who knows what we'll have that others will like. So comment down below with that. Thanks again for all of your support you guys. We are like we said, our family's growing here, our fan bammers, we're getting more and more and more, and we're, we're loving it, you guys. Stay tuned for some more food this coming week. We are going to be excited to get some kids in the kitchen going, some cook with me's, some more recipes, lunch ideas, um, and we have an upcoming grocery haul, you guys. So that's it. Thanks again for watching, and don't forget, choose your day. I would do anything just to get you back again. I would do anything. At all. No, I'm not innocent. You deserve a better man. But let me just hold your hand once more. Ooh, 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 ooh. I wanna take you out.